Former state Senate Majority Leader Kelvin Atkinson pleading guilty to a wire fraud charge for misusing campaign funds. He resigned from office last week. 8 News Now reporter Karen Castro live near Charleston and Main Street. And Karen, the bar behind you was a part of the federal investigation. Yeah, that's right, Brian. That disgraced former state leader uh, is accused, or rather admitted to using campaign funds to open and operate the Urban Lounge, which is right behind me here, this colorful building in downtown Las Vegas. Now, in fact, he admits using at least $250,000 of campaign funds for personal use. But federal prosecutors and investigators believe Atkinson was stealing a lot more. A plea agreement states that between 2010 and 2017, Atkinson did not report more than $450,000 in campaign donations. The court document goes on to say some of this money is unaccounted for, but Atkinson admits to using about half of the unreported campaign donations to pay off $100,000 in credit card debt, a $20,000 lease for a Jaguar SUV, and $75,000 to open and operate his downtown bar, among other personal expenses. Now, it also states that Atkinson was using his personal bank account as his campaign account, which is against state law. Let me be clear. Theft of any kind is unacceptable, but theft of campaign contributions from a sitting public official is particularly troubling. Now, the Nevada Secretary of State tipped off the FBI about two years ago. All campaign contributions and expenses must be reported to this department. Atkinson learned he was under investigation in late January after a search warrant was issued. He was sworn in as the state's Senate Majority Leader last November. He has represented District 4 since 2012 after serving in the State Assembly since 2002. Now, back out here live, Atkinson has not been arrested, but he will be sentenced July 11th. Prosecutors are recommending 33 months in prison and also paying a $250,000 restitution, but he can go to prison for up to 20 years. Reporting live, Karen Castro, 8 News Now.